that stupid clap. Huh? Good at it. Yeah, I could be a professional clapper. Tonight, my wife and I are, are going out. I, I, it's, it's beautiful. We're, uh, we're gonna first, we're gonna go see a ACDC all-woman cover band. And I think that's, that's everything I love about living in the Northwest, just right there. <laughs> then we're going to go uh, hold hands and uh, watch semi-legal professional wrestling uh, in an undisclosed location. They're willing to uh, get, get hit in the face with a folding chair for a punchline. I like to think, you know, if I, if I had the physique and, and the courage, that I'd be a great professional wrestler. But instead, I, I tell poop jokes. Hello. I'm Capitol Hill's Emmett Montgomery, and you're watching Up Late Northwest. <laughs> you know, I think a, a real big difference between Utah and here in Seattle, there's a lot more beverage options. Uh, restaurants, or dive bars, you know, we have all this diversity, and then drinking culture in Utah is really in basements. Sometimes I'll just go and I'll have just one beer. That one beer will be just beautiful. It'll be a beautiful beer made by somebody who loved it very much. I mean, a lot of people, I think, make assumptions. Like, how, what's the secret to a beard? And it's pretty much, it's like, don't put anything sharp against your face. You know, if something comes out, just don't, don't cut it off. I mean, I've been, I've been, I've been shaving since I was 10 years old. There is actually a pretty handsome man. Uh, hidden under here, uh, but then I just I just kind of gave up. I guess the origin of this beard is just failure in time because it grows so fast. You know, I get five o'clock shadow at ten in the morning. There's a length where it kind of turns into like a soft hay. I shampoo it, of course, because I'm not an animal. I just but I just use the same stuff I put on all the hair on my body. You know, because I'm not not a monster. But it is, it, it really, it's kind of an electric fence around my heart. Well, it grows really fast, so my wife was just sick of the razor burn on her face and, and her inner thighs. And, you know, I have a cat. Well, I had a cat, and he would use it as a pillow, and my dog eats pizza out of it, and it, there's all sorts of great things about it. We had a neighbor that was a mountain man. Like, that was like his hobby. Uh, in, in the 80s and 90s, he would, uh, he would go and to mountain man, uh, conventions and he would like you know he'd get really excited you know spend his money on a beer bear carcass and, and make outfits out of it and I always thought it was really cool yeah it was it was a thing uh, maybe it's a very Utah thing I don't know I never explored I don't know I think I think people make a make a lot of uh, assumptions you know when you first see something uh, somebody and they're like oh look at this murder wizard and then uh, I'll, I'll talk about you know how much I love my wife and my dog, and then either they'll they'll be delighted or, or real disappointed on what a softy I am. Hey! <laughs>